Many of us use social media to share photos and updates about our lives with our friends, family, or professional contacts. We don't, however, expect to share personal information with strangers. What may seem like a harmless post to you could provide the personal details a scammer needs to steal your identity, access your account, or track your whereabouts. The good news is that there are simple steps you can take to reduce your social networking risks. Account passwords serve as your first line of defense against fraud. Stack the deck in your favor by creating strong and unique passwords using a combination of upper and lowercase letters, numbers, and symbols. Don't use personal information, such as your pet's name or your graduation year, as your password. Most social media platforms offer privacy settings that allow you to control who can view your online profile and individual posts. Audit your privacy settings regularly and restrict access to friends and known contacts only. Once you make your profile private, examine incoming friend requests carefully. Only accept friend requests from people you know and trust. Review your friend list regularly and rid your account of unwelcome guests. You may not want your ex, for example, hanging around. Keep in mind that online predators can impersonate someone you know by using public photos and information to create a fake or duplicate account. If in doubt, call or text your friend to ensure the account is theirs before accepting. The next step is critical. Be careful what you share online. Avoid oversharing sensitive or personal information that could be used for fraud, identity theft, or other crimes. That includes your home address, phone number, bank or credit card information, and social security number, as well as your school, work, or family information. Malicious links are one of the most common ways hackers manipulate victims into downloading malware. That's why you should always think before you click. Avoid clicking articles with shocking or sensationalized headings or offers that seem too good to be true. Also, be wary of friends that send you a link with a vague or generic message, such as, check this out. Their account may be hacked. Finally, defend your device from cyber attacks by installing antivirus software and keeping your computer operating system, browser, and other programs current. Software updates often include critical security patches, so don't procrastinate installing them. Beyond protecting your personal information, you should also keep in mind the importance of your online reputation. Remember that whatever you post online stays online. Employers have rejected job candidates and even fired current employees for posting unprofessional social media content. So, if you wouldn't want your grandparent, boss, or future employer to see it, then it's probably inappropriate for social media. For example, avoid posting offensive photos or content negative comments about your coworkers or workplace, or information that violates your company's code of conduct or non-disclosure agreement. Social media can be a valuable tool for connecting with others. Just make sure you're in control of who accesses your account and how much information you share. You can practice safe social networking by using strong passwords, managing your privacy settings, and keeping sensitive information offline. If a link or a friend request looks fishy, delete it. And don't forget to update your security software. With these tips, you can keep friends and family in the loop while keeping ill-intentioned individuals out. <laughs>